okay, well, we uh, when when people really get mad because they they don't get their way, how 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 do you think would be a fast way to calm down if if they're in public and 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 they don't want people seeing how mad or ticked off they really are? You just take a deep breath, just breathe, and don't say nothing. Because if you say anything at the time, you're liable to up your set yourself more or them. All right. And it's best just to be quiet and listen and not speak. All right. Well, well, YouTube viewers, I I truly do hope this helps you. But, but remember, whenever whenever you are having trouble doing this, always remember. Philippians 4 says, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Right. Hebrews 13 says, the, the Lord will never leave you nor forsake you. John chapter 8 says, the, the devil, who is also called Satan, is a liar and the father of lies. Matthew 7 says ask and ask and you shall receive and 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 Matthew 6 says that we should always pray uh, about temptation one moment okay sorry I I, I had to mute my TV but listen Matthew 6 says we should always pray about temptation and 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 James chapter 1 says if 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 any of you lack wisdom let him ask of God who giveth to all men liberally and it also says let every man be slow to speak swift to hear and slow to wrath and Isaiah 54 says no weapon formed against us no no weapon formed against us shall prosper and and as i said hebrews 13 says the lord will never leave us nor forsake us matthew 7 says ask and you shall receive and matthew 6 says if we if we forgive those who have sinned against us we will be forgiven but if but if we don't forgive them neither will we be forgiven so so listen to me youtube viewers when when you get angry or upset read 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 at least matthew 6 and 7 with philippians 4 and hebrews 13 and and james chapter 1 with 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 any other passage you might know that can help you and 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 also youtube viewers remember that isaiah 9 says the the messiah who is who is jesus he is also called the prince of peace in isaiah 9 YouTube viewers, remember, Mark 9 says all says all things are possible to those who believe. And and Matthew 7 says ask and ask and you shall receive. And Matthew 6 says if 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 we forgive those who have sinned against us, we will be forgiven. But if we don't forgive them, we will not be forgiven. So so YouTube viewers when, whenever, whenever you are having trouble following Weta's advice, read, read as many of those passages as, as you can and, and, and ask for the Lord's help, not talking, and also ask him for help following Weta's advice. No need to thank me. I hope, I hope this helps you, but please like, share, but please like, share, and subscribe, and also please, please, 
Let me know if, if this helps you in the comments below. Thank you very much.